Phnom Jean with curry is one of the most Phuket things that you can have for breakfast. And my favorite place to have it is here at a place called Pha Mai, which is near Phuket town. It is easily one of my favorite street food stalls in all of Thailand. Like many people, I made the mistake of thinking kanomji means Chinese candy in that it came from the Chinese. Actually, it's a fermented rice noodle that comes from the Mon, which is an ethnic minority in Burma that gradually moved into Thailand. So we have them to thank for this, this noodle dish, which now is used as a base all over Thailand from the north to some thumbs in the northeast to the curries here. This is what you do. You get your cutlery, you get your plate of kanom jean, and then you've got all of your gang. Here, this is beef gang, green curry, which I'm gonna put on this plate because it's delicious. It's got chicken feet in it and bits of blood. It's done the old-fashioned way. <laughs> and the specialty of the house, nam ya, which is the seafood curry. This one is fish. This one is crab, a variation of this nam ya. I'm going to put that on here too. So, this is your plate of kanong tea. So what you do here, as I peel an egg, is you get one platter of kanong jean for 30 baht. And then you are free to put however many curries as you want on it. And you have all these garnishes that you can put on it, like garlic balls, cucumber, bean sprouts, you've got dried fish, you've got pickled cabbage, everything, anything that you could possibly want along with a bunch of fresh ingredients here, like um, mango leaves and baby eggplant and sata and pineapple, which you can also have with nam pikapi, which comes in a tiny little bowl. You can also have hummel, and then you have eggs, which are a, my favorite garnish for kanom jean. So you can have fun playing with all these different flavor combinations and uh, seeing what you like best. I put garlic, dried fish, cucumber and mango leaves on mine and it's delicious. Okay, so uh, she's always done kanom jean and the recipes came from her husband's mother who opened this shop. Everything's delicious. They all do all the pickles, the garnishes, everything here. And um, gang come to chow. They wake up at 3 in the morning, they make all the curries, and then they open at 6 in the morning, and then they're open until noon. Every day. <laughs> she she is open every day, but she's not tired because she says it's fulfilling enough to have a whole bunch of people come and taste her food. It's one of the first places to sell kanom jean in Phuket, and they sold two baht a plate at the beginning. Kanom jean was an easy, convenient dish to make and to serve to people, and that's why they chose it. And, and it, it, it helped five kids go to college. Thank you.